As the COVID-19 pandemic reaches the 18-month mark, scientists have been exploring and developing different treatments and prevention options for this deadly disease. Scientists have recently been making exciting progress in the development of oral pills that have the potential to treat COVID-19. Although these antiviral pills are a new and exciting development at the moment, it is important to take the time to look at all scientific evidence available and decide if they will be an effective method of treatment. To do so, we need to provide some background information on antiviral pills. Here, let us walk you through it. Antiviral drugs are used to treat viral infections. They can be designed to target specific viruses or target a broad spectrum of viruses. Antiviral drugs do not destroy viruses. Instead, they prevent the progression of virus-caused illness in the body by disrupting the viral life cycle, thus lowering the amount of active viruses in the body before they start to replicate out of control. This can also prevent the spread of viruses to other people in addition to treating the infection. Antivirals have been used to treat several infections like Ebola, the flu, herpes, hepatitis B and C, HIV, and also coronaviruses like COVID-19. These antivirals can be delivered in many forms, like through an intravenous injection, a spray form, or cream, but oral pill form is very commonly used and easy to take. There are currently two forerunners in the development of oral antiviral pills for COVID-19. Molnupiravir and Pfizer's drug, PF0732132. These drugs have the potential to become the first COVID-19 treatable pills that you can take in your own home. Molnupiravir is currently being developed by Merck & Co for the treatment of mild to moderate COVID-19 infection. It has recently finished stage three testing, which means it was tested on human subjects positive for COVID-19. Based on the successful outcomes of this study, Merck & Co ended the phase three research early and have submitted an application for FDA approval in October 2021. Once taken, Molnupiravir is incorporated into the genetic material of the virus that causes COVID-19, SARS-CoV-2. There, it introduces errors and prevents the virus from further replicating its RNA. Once these errors build up, the virus can no longer reproduce and spread throughout its host. Molnupiravir is suggested to be able to cut down COVID-19 hospitalizations and deaths in half, which is a very promising result. The antiviral pill that Pfizer is developing, PF0732132, is currently going through phase 3 testing in human subjects with COVID-19. This drug is being combined with another therapy in order to treat patients who are at risk to progress to severe illness. The Pfizer drug is part of a class of antivirals called protease inhibitors. Protease inhibitors prevent the virus from reproducing by attaching to vital enzymes that break down proteins. Without certain proteins being broken down, the virus cannot accumulate the necessary components to reproduce its genetic material and thus cannot spread. While these antiviral pills have the potential to be effective and easy to use, they should not be taken in place of vaccines for the prevention of COVID-19 infection. These drugs are to be used as an additional tool alongside vaccines and can only treat those who are already infected while vaccines can prevent infection. Antiviral pills work best if they are taken early in the infection process. So if you start to experience COVID-19 symptoms, don't hesitate to get tested. Hopefully, antiviral pills will be out soon on the market to further help us combat COVID-19 and make treatment easy.